super early, so that's why I'm talking a little bit lower. So basically I'm preparing myself to go to the gym to take advantage of the time that everyone else is uh, sleeping. So I'm gonna be taking this uh, this thing, uh, which is a pre-workout. Also, I'm gonna be taking the creatine and I'm gonna be testing this one, okay? So I have high expectations for this one, which is the, I think it's gonna be the one that is gonna be kind of like the white monster, which is my favorite. So let's see, let's see. So guys, let me put a pause here. Let's run the intro. Remember, uh, if you're new to the channel, uh, subscribe. And don't forget to like the video. That helps a lot with the, you know, with YouTube and all the algorithm and all that thing. So thank you so much. See you in a little bit. So today I'm gonna try to make this uh, kind of like a full day of eating. So you see how I eat in and everything. So something that I want to mention is uh, one of the reasons why I haven't done like a, like a real full day of eating, even though I have recorded like I have a plenty of footage of uh, you know uh, meeting and having um, you know a recording meals and stuff like that is that um, I'm running so low in in calories during this cold cut that um that you know to show meals that are not gonna be fun and that it's gonna be like super bland and stuff like that um i don't think it's that fun i don't think it's that fun it's, it's funny when you do like a food day of uh eating with you know like going out uh, or cooking interesting things or something like that but to watch me like eating oatmeal and chicken breast and white rice and stuff like that <laughs> I don't think it's gonna be that uh, you know that you know that entertaining but um, well people are asking for the full day of eating so today I'm gonna I'm gonna push my best to you know to give you the full day of eating with the calories and all that craziness and maybe the edit is not that good um, reason why is uh, as, as you can see right now I'm basically doing my my videos like in the day like for example yesterday video was like filming yesterday and was uploaded in the afternoon yesterday so the time that I'm having to be able to do this uh, you know the edits and all that is super limited because I'm posting daily so but either way we gotta do what we gotta do um let me put a pause here just to, to get into the to the gym okay actually I, I uh, let me let me put a pause here because before going to the gym i'm gonna test the 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 one the 3d energy for uh the white one so see you in like two minutes okay so let's test this out this is cold i don't know if you can see like the all this condensation that is um that is happening here so i'm i'm excited i'm afraid and also excited at the same time because monster the white one is really good so let's see this one The taste is different than the monster. It's not it's not the same type of uh, taste of the monster. So if you're going if you're going into this thinking that it's gonna taste kind of like the white monster, I don't I don't think it tastes like the white monster. It's different. It's, that it's a different taste. So. It's really good. 
it's really good like the taste is super good i know the as i told you before with all the reviews of the 3d i know the um, the performance is amazing because it's uh it's a lot of um caffeine like for example for the can um you have here um just one second i forget the exact number but um jesus where is the caffeine oh jesus way on the top 200 milligrams of uh, caffeine per can of course so um, this is um this is a good amount this is kind of like a pre-workout basically that's why um i didn't do the the whole scoop of the other one that i was taking um but this is um kind of like a you know literally like a pre-workout if you it's not for you to take it as a pre-workout but um you know compar in comparison with the amount of uh you know of uh, caffeine and everything it's kind of like a pre-workout it's not gonna give you the jittery or the crazy of a pre-workout but it's you're gonna feel like super energetic and something that i have seen with this um with this thing for some reasons um you know when you drink so much coffee or something like that you crash on this one the crashing is i haven't feel it i have honestly i haven't feel it i don't know if it's placebo or something like that but i haven't feel it at all the crash um but yeah the taste is really good in on a scale of um 10 i would give uh, uh, like an 8 on this one the orange one is amazing the orange one is like a 10 out of 10 in taste this one is uh kind of like a 8 out of 10 in comparison with the white monster i like a little bit better the white monster compared to this one okay so um, there is not um there is not like um um like a crazy difference but uh yeah the taste of the white monster is a little bit better than this one in my opinion um the amount of energy on this one is way better than the white monster now the jesus allergies so now the orange one is uh i haven't tasted a monster that tastes as good as the orange one and also the the one that is uh the the one that i review uh i think it was uh two videos ago or something like that which is uh the light blue one which is uh in my opinion blackberry that one is crazy good like amazing good like that one pass over all the the freaking monsters okay so yeah i'm gonna keep enjoying this one sipping on this one and then we're gonna go and kill a workout so see you guys in our little little bit so super important um before working out try to do some home work rolling uh, that helps you like fresh out your muscle and remove any tight tightness so let me put a pause here so i'm red as hell jesus with the contrast basically the first move that i'm gonna be doing is gonna be a 5 by 5 of ropes so so the second exercise that I'm going to be doing is going to be a uh, 4x10 uh, of lat puts down, wide lat puts down. So basically, um, the cue that I use here is like cool, uh, fast, but control on the back in the you know the contraction, and you know and release slow. 
So let me see if I can put here something so we can see it. So yeah, that's basically it. Uh, now I'm gonna be increasing a little bit more the weight and repeating. So basically, uh, something that I forgot to mention is that uh, when I'm doing the setup, basically what I do, I retract my scapula. That way, uh, you know, it's more, uh, you know, you're engaging more the the back instead of the shoulders and all that. So let's put a pause here. So uh, the next one is going to be uh, lats, machine roll, so that's for the back. So basically I'm going to be doing a 3 by 10 single arm, so let me put you here.
clubhouse here and see you in the night as well. So now let's give a, a break to the arms and I'm gonna do a lat push down with the rocks. So let me put you here. Okay, I just finished up working out. I'm feeling, I'm feeling still energetic. That's really good. Um, and I killed it on the workout. I like, I, I went all like all, all out and everything. So let me show you something real quick that is super important when you are in traveling or something like that. Is to um, a lot of people they um, they messed up on the on the protein intake and also getting to the macros and stuff like that. So for example, I'm not in like a, you know, in like a vacation trip or something like that. I'm basically in a friend's house and um, you know, uh, I'm Latin. So Latin people, we uh, cook with a lot of fats and not the most healthy thing, okay? So I'm not gonna make them, you know, like do boiled chicken or something like that because that's gonna be, you know, completely bad for uh, uh, for me so something that i normally do is like most of the time in all of the you know like decent gyms uh they prepare food and they have like some things that are maybe not a hundred percent accurate but they are healthy and they're close to what you know what they're putting on the label so for example something that i did um today and i normally do is um here I got a little bag which has, um, for example, this one is only chicken. Okay, so the macros on this is uh, 36 uh, grams of protein and also uh, 2.5 grams of fat and not carbohydrates. Okay, so the next thing that I did just to be, um, you know, sure and everything, this one is a mix of, um, this is chicken sweet potato and seasonal veggies okay so here as the veggies i see here is like carrots uh green beans and um something else there that i don't see that that well but let me tell you the macros on this like the protein intake is 36 grams 
so similar to this one and carbs is 30 and fats is fat, five so not bad at all so what i do basically is um for example i'm not um i haven't break my fast yet i'm doing some fasting so i'm gonna break it around like 3 p.m or something like that okay so i'm gonna break my fast and i'm gonna show you a little bit later with um i have uh, this green juice of uh soha drinks and also two scoops of uh protein and two scoops of mct oil which is uh you know it's gonna be the main fat source of my diet while traveling because uh, i'm not gonna be taking like all this uh cook oils and stuff like that it's not that healthy and i'm getting closer to the competition so i need to be like drilled down on whatever i'm doing so this is gonna be like one meal after that and then i have the same thing here but well, this, this one it looks a little bit um uh, you know clear so you see there the sweet potato also the green bean chickens and um carrots so basically i'm gonna be taking uh that one later on at night and i'm gonna take also um like a snack another suha drink um that is gonna be um cysting um, um, it's gonna be 16 ounces and also one and a half scoops of protein of ghost uh, that way it fills up all my macros with no issues for today so remember I'm running a little bit low on right now on this trip that I'm doing I'm running a little bit low the carbs and also I'm running a little bit low the fats okay reason why um, as you saw in previous videos um i'm traveling but i'm doing kind of like a test like uh for example um i'm going some days high fat okay low carbs um but now and then i'm lowering the carbs sorry i'm keeping the carbs low and also i'm lowering the fats okay so my body what i'm assuming okay i'm not 100 percent sure this is a test that i'm doing on me I'm not a nutritionist, I'm not a, you know, like an expert or anything like that. It's a test that I'm doing. Like, for example, uh, when you're running high on fats, um, as per, you know, as per uh, studies and stuff like that, um, you know, your body get used to use fat as, um, you know, as, as a source of uh, energy, basically. So that's getting into ketosis and all that, okay? so if one of those days okay i lower also the fat my body is not gonna have other choice in my opinion in my opinion again this is a test of me in my opinion um to use fat as a as a basically as a energy source so because i'm also keeping a little bit low the the carbs so what i'm assuming is that that day is gonna compile like if i do this in the last um four to six of uh, four weeks that i have for the competition or five weeks that i have for the competition then basically it's gonna be something that is gonna compile and and let's see what happens let's see what happens uh am i gonna be shredded for the competition I don't think so uh, I thought it was going to be easier but it's not that easy um, and of course I'm not doing something crazy or drastic like uh, you know like uh, like other people maybe but uh, you know I'm, I'm doing my best to to bring like a healthy basic and you know I'm feeling as best as possible and looking as best as possible I already I'm, I'm already happy as hell like super happy I just, you know, I have dropped a lot of weight. Um, you know, I feel energetic. Um, I'm, you know, I'm getting more, I, I feel more fresh, basically. So yeah, let's put a pause here and let's, uh, I think this is gonna be like a long, long video, like really long. So let's see, let's see, hope. Guys, don't, don't skip out the video, please. Don't close it, keep watching it. So um, yeah. Let's put a pause here and let's keep on, you know, see you in a little bit. 
So, okay, um, I'm gonna be breaking the fast as I told you before. This is gonna be um, 16 ounces of uh, Suha All Greens and also two scoops of uh, ghost protein and two uh, tablespoons of MCT oil. So yeah, something to kick up the day. The combination doesn't taste like amazing, but you know, we gotta do what we gotta do, basically. So let's put a pause here and I'm gonna show you the next one. So this is gonna be the next meal. It's basically, as I told you before, chicken sweet potato and green beans and carrots so let me put a pause here while I'm enjoying this so guys uh, basically I'm here in like an antique type of uh, museum so look at this so let's see how much I weigh <laughs> so as you can see here it's like I think it's locked but something to do <laughs> it's not working but <laughs> So another weird place. You're talking about you're talking about leg day. The people here had to like literally pedal, pedal for this thing to work. Okay? So they were doing leg day, but then <laughs> just kidding, I don't know. This is so, such a random video, so <laughs> just keep watching. So yeah, basically it's around like 6 uh, 30 p.m. So um, I'm gonna be getting my last meal, uh, which is gonna be, again, the same thing, nothing fancy. Um, I'm gonna be putting the macro so you can see it uh, on the on the on the thing, and you have uh, on the video, and you have a more accurate thing um, perspective of uh, how many calories I get. So yeah. That's basically it's nothing fancy. That's the that's the reason why I didn't want to do like a full day of eating yet because since I'm being so restricted right now in the you know in what I'm eating, it's not gonna be that fun. But hope you like it and this is reality, that's what happens. So if you like this video please share, comment and subscribe and have a wonderful day. I'm done for the day, so tired. Let me get some sparkling water. I'm rest a little bit. See you guys.